This is Corey. And this is Danielle. Today we're going to be talking about photosynthesis and cellular respiration using a brownie recipe. This is our end product of our brownie mixture, which signifies the end of cellular respiration and photosynthesis, which is ATP. To start, the breakdown of the recipe relates to the breakdown of glucose into 2 ATP, 2 pyruvate, and 2 NADH. Water represents carbon dioxide, oil represents oxygen, and eggs represent glucose. Like photosynthesis and cellular respiration, several steps are needed in the process of making brownies. Step one, put the brownie mix or organic compounds into the bowl. Step two, we add the eggs, which would be the glucose. Step three, add the water or the CO2. And step three, add the oil or the oxygen. Next, the brownie mix is put in the oven representing light reactions because sunlight is required. Then, the heat of the oven symbolizes the sunlight. The temperature is needed for the brownies like the sunlight is needed for photosynthesis. Finally, the end product is the baked brownies, which is like ATP, the end product of cellular respiration. Put the brownie mix or the organic compounds into the bowl. Step two would be to add in the eggs, which would be the glucose. Oh, we need to retake that whole. Oh crap! <laughs> Finally, the end product. <laughs> Finally, the end product is the baked brownies, which is Sarah. Sarah. You're filming. <laughs>